Welcome back to this special edition of Hannity. House Oversight Committee Chairman James Comer is sounding the alarm over possible witness intimidation in the Hunter Biden probe. He says some witnesses are now fearing for their lives and are afraid to come forward. So what does that mean for the IRS whistleblower accusing the government of interfering with the investigation into Hunter's taxes? Well, during recent congressional testimony, the IRS commissioner promised there would be no retaliation for anyone making allegations against the agency. Here now with the latest on all of this is House Oversight Committee Chairman James Comer. Uh, uh, Representative Comer, thank you very much for being here with me tonight. Normally, when I am guest hosting for Sean, I'm the one that tends to bite you. And uh, but you, you're such a very good sport, and you're doing a great job. And this issue has become dr just dramatically serious. Uh, you know, the Hunter Biden thing is really about Joe Biden and that, that family and the corruption of that family. But it's also about the security of this country and if our agencies have been weaponized against the American people. These are serious allegations. How do you how do you see this when it comes to the nature of threats that might might may have already been issued? And what are we going to do about it? Well, it's very concerning, and I'm sounding the alarm publicly. Uh, we know that some on Hunter Biden's legal team have made contact with some people that we've been communicating with to get information. We know that some on Hunter Biden legal team have uh, reached out and uh, communicated with uh, some of the people that and institutions that we've subpoenaed. Wow. We know that uh, people within the Biden administration have reached out and expressed their disappointment with some of the people that have been subpoenaed and some of the people that are cooperating with us. And this is very concerning because this is an investigation about public corruption <laughs> at the highest levels. This is an investigation to determine whether or not our White House and, our, and this administration's compromised because of the millions and millions of dollars they've taken from adversaries around the world. So uh, we've got a situation where there are more and more people coming forward. You know, we're very thankful for the IRS whistleblower. And I'm pretty confident in the next few weeks we're going to have more whistleblowers come forward. So it's very important that our whistleblowers are protected and the Democrat politicians, the media, and uh, the legal team for the Biden family, they need to be very careful in not intimidating our witnesses, because we need to get the truth and present the facts to the American people. You know, in the normal world, sir, if you were intimidating witnesses during an investigation, that would be a crime. Uh, is there, uh, and talking about it publicly is important, but it, it kind of also proves the point of why we need to investigate this family, because this is part and parcel of the corruption, when you're going out there trying to scare people into not talking. Is there anything else we can do to keep this from continuing, to make these whistleblowers feel safe enough to come forward? Well, we're sounding the alarm, as I said. Uh, we're, we have every Republican eye in Washington, D.C., on the whistleblower that, with the IRS that's going to come forward. We're going to make sure they're not retaliated. We're going to make sure that they're not intimidated. And we're going to make sure they can present the, the truth. You also have a situation where many of these people who were in the Biden uh, influence sphere uh, with the influence peddling scheme, they want to come forward and they want to tell the truth. But not only are they worried about Biden's lawyers and, and Democrat politicians and the media, they're also worried about some of these foreign nationals that they've been dealing with. Look, this money's not coming uh, from the, the best and brightest in our adversarial country. The, yeah. This money's coming from bad actors Great in point. bad countries. And that's why every American should be concerned that, uh, that we are successful in our investigation in getting every bit of evidence and presenting it to the American people without intimidation or, or without uh, any type of obstruction from this White House yeah. or this Department of Justice. Well, sir, uh, if anyone can do it, you can. And it is good that the American people know that this is happening. And you turn the light on, and it does seem to keep people uh, a bit safer, because they're the, the country's at stake here. Uh, th uh, Chairman James Comer, thank you very much, sir. I appreciate it. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.